Oh. And there's a bonfire. You don't have to sit at this if you don't want to. You can go back to the last bonfire, but um, you can use your homeward bone. Then go back to fire link. And not fire link, but the uh, bottom of the thing. Um. And then I'll I'll lead you to the shortcut to fire link. Okay, so we can get a spell. All right, let me use a little bit of my. Oh fuck. Yeah. I'm just glad they don't make any sound when I get poisoned. That'd be so annoying. Like, uh... <laughs> so you're here now. You want to go across this, that, that little walkway, and then turn left. And there should be an elevator. Here, or... Okay, let me yield quick check the... To the left. It should be an elevator to the left now. Here, yeah, maybe? Yeah. This, this, uh, game's really about its, like, verticality and it has a huge interconnected wire. Oh, yeah, by the way, she died. Um, what? We'll be in a battery life later. Um, but she's dead yet now. Who died? Uh, the fi oh, filing strand doesn't work yet. No. Oh. You can try lighting the bonfire, I don't know what it'll do. Yeah. So, um, she's dead yet now, but we'll get by for late, uh, a bit, just a bit later in the game. Um, it's just a, basically an annoyance. Did you see them? The three young clerics headed for the catacombs to seek kindling. Kindling oh. is the art of feeding bonfires. The poor young girl sent down into a tomb. What a terrible mission she is burdened with. You actually missed a lot of stuff. Um. Oh, hello. Well, you certainly are keeping at it. Myself? I'm fine. Let's get started straight away. If you go to the eighth a bit... Um, I don't think you have the gold. No, you don't have the souls, I mean. Yeah, sad. Um, I, had, I had the thing. souls. I had the souls, bro. Billing, sorry. Goodbye, but you, you need... I, I'm going to have you upgrade your melee weapon to do magic damage in a bit. Um, so, that'll be fun for you. Oh, hello, hey. you I'm pleased to see you safe. Oh, and uh, if by chance you've had a change of hearts... I'll be pleased to assist you by sharing my spells. Yeah, wonderful. I'm sure that you know, they'll be of some use, some assistance. Here, first take this. A flame from the Great Swamp. Now you're a fully-fledged pyromancer. Well, let's get started right now. Alrighty. <laughs> This is also how you get to the next area, but I'm not going to have you go there yet, because I want you to up here to your weapon, so it'll do damage. Did you see any chaos? Ah, why, that's a fine ember you have there. I could smith some mighty weapons with one of those. Why not lend it to me? Magnificent! You won't be disappointed. I can hardly wait to get started. Okay. So you want to purchase some items. Um, you'll need to buy uh, seven of these. So you have nine, I believe. Yeah. Okay, and then upgrade your item. Go back to upgrading your items. Um, and you enforce weapon. And so now pick the weapon you wanna you wanna keep using. Probably short sword, right? Um, yeah, you can use short sword. Short sword sounds fine to me. Um, so click the short sword, and you want to upgrade it to plus five. Okay. Okay. 
Now we need to go to a different blacksmith. So if you want to go back to Freilung Shine. Where's my short sword five? Oh, it's, it's, don't worry, don't you're fine. Get yourself killed. If you want to, uh, make sure you have the short sword five equipped. There you go. You know what? And now if we go back to Firelink, we're going to go to a different blacksmith. Hmm? Well, this is unusual. You haven't lost your head. And more importantly, you're free. How on earth? Well, I shouldn't pry. I'm Ricky of Vinheim. I was once an established smith, but look at me now. Can you believe it? Hmm? What is it? Have you? Oh no. Don't worry. I've no intention of escape. It's safe here. I can't bear the thought of going hollow out there. Although, I must admit, I've not much to occupy myself. How about this? I could forge your weapons, albeit with rather minimal tools. I'll show you what made me the best in Vinod. Okay, now what? Um, so you want a yin fast force weapon? Um, oh, oh wait. Go back. Sorry, it's, I think it's modify weapon. Modify equipment? And you want to make that short sword a magic sword sword. Okay. There you go. Yeah. Make, ascend it. Okay, and now you can go back. And you enforce weapons. And you need for, oh, you don't have any Gene Titanite. Never mind. Uh, so you can see if you can buy some Gene Titanite. I don't know if he sells it. No, he doesn't. Goodbye then. Keep your head on up. But if you want to attack one of those guys, not the, that one, probably, but and see how much more damage you do. Like a lot Double. more damage. I'll turn it back up to 60 eventually. When I'm done with Xenoblade, I'll turn it back up to 60. Because yeah. the video's looking a little bit choppy, but whatever. Yeah, so anyway, the using the um the firekeeper is dead. Um was a reason you completely didn't hold this because you triggered the story beat and then there was an NPC here, and then you triggered the second story beat, and then the NPC killed her and left. Um don't fall down. Ah, you will die. Hello. Was it you who rang the bell of awakening? Yeah. I am the primordial serpent, King Seeker Frampt. Frampt on these nuts. Of the great <laughs> Lord Gwyn, chosen undead, who has rung the bell of awakening. I wish to elucidate your fate. Do you seek such enlightenment? Very well. Then I am pleased to share. Okay. Chosen undead. Your fate is to succeed the great Lord Gwyn. I don't so know who that, that is. you may link the fire. Uh, he's the dude from the, the dark, opening cutscene. And undo uh. the curse of the undead. To this end. Chosen. Oh. All right, Kieran. Where? You know what I feel like doing right now? What? Which one do I do? Lingering or bellowing? Um, bellowing increases damage. Um, thinking is bad. All right. And you just want to make sure you equip that. Uh, I think that should be 13. I'll see you in episode 13, guys. See you later. Do we want to stop recording for now? Kieran, say bye. Oh, bye. <laughs> <laughs>